Crime ends in a trap that justice sets. Crime does not pay. Thank you for calling support. You are speaking with Kevin. How can I help you today? I got a thing that my computer got blocked for security reasons. Do you know anything about that? It says to call this number. Sure, we can help you out on. Okay. Beg your pardon? I said okay. What message are you getting on the computer, sir? Access to this PC has been blocked for security reasons. App adds finance track two DLL threat detected Trojan spy where it said. And uh, may I know what was you are doing on the machine, sir, when it happened? I, I was looking looking at uh, uh, certain videos. And if you can tell me, like, what kind of videos was that, sir? Certain videos. Well, it looks like, sir, that your computer detects a suspicious activity where someone is trying to misuse your personal and financial information, sir. Uh-oh. So for your safety and security, your computer has been turned down. Okay. How, how do we fix this? All right. I, I, I'll just shut my computer off. Will that make it go away? No, what I will do, no. I will. okay. No, sir, I will what? guide you with some. Some. We will guide uh, you with some uh -huh. technical steps to which you. Ah, uh, okay. Sir? All right. I'm going to guide you with some. Okay. Are you listening to me? Yes. What I'm saying, sir, I will guide you with some technical steps okay. which you have to follow so that we can connect you with our technical desk. Okay. All right. Yeah, all right. So, could you please help me out with the last four digit of your phone number, sir, by which you are calling? The last four numbers. Eight four zero one. Eight four zero one. Thank you so much. Okay. And right now, uh, you are you are working on a computer, sir, or it's a laptop? It's an iPad, tablet. What device a, is this? It's a lap desktop. It's a desktop. Look on your desktop. Can you see the control key, sir, on your keyboard? Yes. And next to control okay. key, which key is there next to it? So it looks like a flag, you mean? Yes. You need to press and hold the flag key along with letter R key together. Okay. Now what? Now what Now what came up? So says type the name of a program or folder, document, internet resource. Okay. Now what? And there you there you can see an open box where you can type something. Yes, open. yes, I do. Is the box empty or something is in the box? No, it's empty. Type in there www dot w, w, w dot then rust r u s t rust R -U desk R -U dot com rust what got him desk d e s k d e s k dot com okay I did that. Now, please press OK. OK. Rust Desk, open source virtual remote desktop infrastructure for everyone. All right, sir. And there okay. you'll be getting an option that says download. Can you yes. see that download? It says download, yes. Okay. Click on download. Click on that. Download. Now what came up? Nothing. There's a thing down in the corner, Rust Desk. Win zip. Is that what you mean? Right, sir. Click on it. Okay. Okay, then I don't know what this is. Now what do I do? Now what what does it say, sir, if you tell me? It says uh add, extract to, test, view, delete, find, wizard, info. What other options you are getting there, sir? I just read them out to yeah, you. Click on Rust Test one point one point. Okay, installation path. Okay. Click on accept and install. Okay, your desktop, control desktop. Make your pardon? I, I don't know, it says control remote desktop. Your desktop. And are you the only person, sir, who used this computer, or somebody also used this computer apart from you? Uh, no, just me and my cousin, Eddie. And basically, for what purpose you use this computer, sir? What you do on this machine? It's a home computer. I pay my bills. I look at my email. What do you mean? What do you use a computer for? 
No, I mean, uh, basically, what is, I mean, what basically, you do on this computer so regularly. I, I just told you. I pay my bills, look mm -hmm. at email, and Eddie looks at gilfs and uh, that sort of thing. And, uh, like, you both use the computer. So if you recall, so, like, in the last couple of days, have you ever clicked on any unknown site from the machine? I, I didn't, no. Can you tell me the ID number which you have there, sir? The ID number? ID number, 1563424440. Now, do one thing, sir. From your keyboard, press the window key and R key together, which we did before, the window and R. Okay. Now, what came up? That run box. Sorry? The run box, you said. All right, and there you can see it says www.rustest.com. Yes, it does. Make it empty, sir. Make it empty. Make the box Back. empty. Okay, it's empty. Okay. Now it's type empty. in there. That is www. www. I'm sorry, not www. Not, you have no, to, no, 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 no. no, no. no. Okay, I'm Back. sorry, you Back. have to make okay. it empty. Okay, it's empty no. again. Type in there event, like E V E N T event. V for Victor. Now please. Press OK there on the bottom, sir. Please press OK. Okay, this thing came up. What does it say? It says Event Viewer. Overview and Summary. Make it bigger, sir. Maximize the space. So she said, okay. Maximize it, sir. I did. Now, on the left-hand side, you'll be getting says Custom Views there. You see that Custom Views? Uh, yeah. Double, double click on Administrative Events. <sighs> okay. Now what? Now what came up, sir? Now what came up? Oh, it says error, warning, warning, error, warning, warning, error, warning, warning, error, error, exactly. warning, error, warning, warning. A bunch of error, error, error. So do you have any idea like what these are and what they are doing inside your machine, sir? Do you have any idea about this? No. What are they? I don't know what they are. These are all the hot trojans and the malicious programs which are automatically getting downloaded into your system, sir, from the internet the time when you go online, okay? Oh, time when you go online, check your mail or doing banking or any other stuff. All that point of time, these things are happening. Okay. And they are very harmful in nature, sir. Harmful. The time when they get downloaded into your system, what they do is like, yes, okay. they took a bit longer space on your computer memory. Okay. And slowly and gradually, they start hampering all of your services, sir. Okay? Okay, how do you get rid of them? Right, sir. And the reason why it is happening because you do not have any kind of protection running on the machine, sir. That's how these things were happening. Oh. So how do we fix it? Uh, sir, in um, order to get it fixed, what? first okay. of all, what we have to do is like we have to we need to go ahead and we need to go ahead and we need to do a com do we need to do a cleanup of your computer, sir. We need to okay. do a cleanup of your computer. Okay. Can I do that? Do mm -hmm. I know how to do that? We will do it, sir. You cannot do it. I can't, okay. Yeah, you cannot do it by your own site. No, okay. Right. And apart from All right. Now press the window key and R key together. Press the window and R together again. Okay. Now make the box empty where you have typed that event VWR. You have to make it empty, sir. Okay, it's empty again. Now type in there MS config. MS config, okay. What do you have typed, sir? MS config, you typed it? Yeah, you told me to. Please press OK now, sir. Please press OK. Now, this other thing came up. System what came up? configuration. There, click on services. Click on services. Services. Bunch of stuff. Running, running, running. Stop, stop, stop. Running, running. I don't know what this means either. All right, sir. So this is... Sorry? I don't know what this means either. These are the inbuilt services of your machine, sir, which always needs to be in running condition. Always, okay. In order to protect your personal and your financial information. Oh, okay. Well, it's not working then. Huh? Let me tell you, sir. In order... Tell me, okay. All right. And in order to get it fixed, sir, mm -hmm. we need to use some sort of security tools. And for that, there will be a one there will be a one time of the fixation charge, including on it. A fixation charge? Okay. Okay. How much that is... Will be... how, how much is yes, it? Yes, sir. How much that, is it? That will be... That will be three hundred ninety nine dollars, like four hundred dollars for the fixation. Four hundred dollars for fixation? I'm not paying that much. Oh my gosh. Well, but that is the standard. Standard. That is the standard charge for the fixation, sir. I think I just restarted. I don't need all that fixation for that price. 
Sir, I mean, restarting the computer is definitely not going to give you any solution because the problem is not on the computer, sir. The problem is on your internet, okay? Your uh, internet is not protected right this moment, sir. Oh, I'll be a son of a bitch. Oh, I can't afford that. I bet you, let's see. You cannot afford that? No. I'm a social security. Can't afford that. Is there a cheaper way to do I'm it? I'm so sorry, sir. I don't know what to say, but that is... Uh -huh. How about a hundred? The cheaper is like uh, there is no no. No what? No, sir. No, we can't no. do it on hundred. Can't do it on a hundred. Okay. What can you do it for? Thirty rupees? You scamming it piece will be of shit. It's three hundred ninety-nine dollars. Oh, what? What'd you say, scammer? I didn't hear you. Thirty rupees. Huh? You said thirty you, rupees. You chutia. Mm -hmm. Chutia. <laughs> oh, chutia. I did, sir. That's what you. You piece of shit, scamming bastard! Okay. You, you think these are all bad? I was doing eh? what, 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 what you were doing? You stupid fuck! The board, how may I help you? I was talking to some other benchode about my computer, and we got disconnected. Barry, come again. What happened? Come again? I got disconnected from the other benchode I was talking to. Well, uh -huh. Yeah. So, can we fix this and thing? And at that time, Paul got disconnected. Uh, yeah, that's, we were connected, then we got disconnected. What do you think, Chudia? Okay, and can you tell me to whom you were speaking with? Ah, uh, gee, Daryl, da I don't know what his name was. Do you know? Okay, and at the time when they called, what? said what happened? He was talking to you he or what? He was talking to me, and I said, what are you doing, Chutia? And he hung up on me. What like, what did you ask him? I asked him what he was doing on my computer. He was showing me all these errors and everything, Benchoad. I think I called him a piece of shit, too, and a scam ambassador. Do you think that might have got him? What's your name, sir? Who are you? Who am I? Peter Piper. Uh -huh. I'm Peter Piper. Peter Piper. Picked a peck of You're Peter Piper. Peppers. That's great. You're Peter Piper. Yes. And so, what are we going to do here, uh, Benchoad? Thank you for calling technical support. My name is Lenny. How can I help you today? My computer got blocked, Lenny. Said what call. happened on your computer? It, yeah, said, no? it said to call his number. It says it's blocked. All right. Now what? Uh, so tell me, sir, what tell exactly uh, can you see on your computer? I, it's blocked. I can't see nothing. I can't go nowhere. Can't do anything with it. What are we going to do, Lenny? I'm sorry, sir. Uh, I don't what are you think sorry uh, for? if your computer is black, there. You're sorry? I'm sorry? You're sorry, too? Okay, what are we going to do, How Lenny? How can I help you today, sir? Well, I want you to stop scamming people, you scamming bastard piece of shit. That's what I really want. But that's not going to happen, is it, Ben Cho? How can I help you today? You can help me by stop scamming people. How can I help you today? I told you, stop scamming people, you fuck! Were you deaf along with being stupid? How can I help you today? Well, how can I help you today? How can I help you today? How can I help you? Well, go up back and fuck a goat, will ya? I'm sorry, I can't hear your voice. You can't hear me? Oh, well, I... Is there something on the background? Huh? I cannot hear anything. You Is can't there hear anything me? on the background? I cannot hear you. Oh, you can't hear me. Why, you scamming piece of shit. Thank you for calling support. This is Alex. How may I help you today? Goddamn! 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 Fuck you, man! Hello? I'm a candy in the goddamn freezer! Hello? For me. For fucking me. It's gone. Where's my goddamn candy? Fuck your copy, did you out these shit, motherfucker? Oh, hello? Hello? Ben showed you there? Hello? 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 Can you hear me now? Hello? Motherfucker? Hey. You fucking bitch? You oh. son of a bitch? Oh, you fucking scammer. Thank you the number you have dialed oh, cannot be reached from your calling area. Hello? Hello? Yes, sir. How can I help you? My computer's blocked. Yes. Okay. 
Okay. What do you see on the screen? It, it says Windows Defender Security Center uh, access this PC has been blocked for security reasons. Call this number. Okay. Did you click on any advertisement, sir? Where are you? In a trash can? I can't hear you. Did you click on any advertisement? No. It seems like your computer has been compromised. Let me provide you some troubleshooting steps so that I can understand the issue. Okay? Okay. Now look at the bottom left side on your keyboard. Okay. Do you see the PCRL, the control key? Uh, Eddie, calm down. What did you say? Do you see the CTRL, the control key? Yes. And do you see the Windows key? Yes. So first you have to press and hold down the control key. While holding it down, press and hold down the Windows key. And while holding both the keys down, hold. Oh, I've got enough fingers. On the letter Q. I haven't got enough fingers. Quick assist. Put your phone aside and try. Yes. Okay. Do you see code from assistant? Yeah. Okay. Just give me a moment. I'll oh. generate the code for you. Okay, Randy. You can release your fingers from the keyboard. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you for calling our line support. This is Nick. How I help you? Hello? 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 Hello. Hello. Uh, Can you hear me? Yeah. Hello. I'm here. Yeah. Thank you for calling. This is Nick. Okay. Yeah. What is your concern, sir? Well, I was talking to some Rundy and she hung what up on me. Concern? Let me talk to the Rundy in the office there. Okay. How many Rundys work there? I'm sorry? How many Rundys were there? I was talking to one of them. What is your concern? I told you I was talking to a run dealer and we got disconnected. You were talking to the drug dealer. The drug dealer? No. You were talking to a drug dealer. No, it was a run What and are you're you talking a bench about? Ode, you piece of shit. Scamming piece of shit. I'll call you fuckers all day, you know that? Because I hate you people. How many? How many your father? How many your father? How many your father? Many what your the father? fuck does that mean? How many your father? How, what the how fuck does father? that mean, you idiot? I, I you piece mind. of shit. What the fuck does that mean? Thank you for calling support. Can I help you? Yes, hello. Is uh, Mike Prince there? Hello. I need support here. Yes, sir. Can you give me that name again? I need support. Yes, sir. Can you give me that name again? It was Daryl Waltrip. Yes, Daryl Waltrip I was talking to. Okay. The what? You may know the purpose of the call. The purpose of the call? You My computer's fucking blocked. Call. What do you think the purpose is? Huh? Okay. You think I want to line on the basketball game? Huh? Sure, can you give me the name of the person again? I forgot it. It was Lucas. It was one of those scam ambassadors there. I don't know his name. Okay. And then, sure, I guess you're having the same number again? Yeah, I kept on calling. Hey, I'm going to get out of jail. And you stupid fuckers keep on answering. <laughs> you fuck. The number you have dialed cannot be weak. All characters, names, places, and plots used in your program are fictitious. Any similarity to persons living or dead is purely coincidental.